This is the signing we were talking about yesterday that could happen, and this got done very quickly. Let's talk about it. Hello and welcome to this video. I hope you're all doing well. I am back from the dentist. Normally, I would have this video out as soon as it came out two hours ago, but I've been busy. I've had drilling and stuff. Note to tell, don't book dentist appointments during the transfer window next time. But... EK, I think they say Ug Ugbo, has signed for Sheffield Wednesday for the remainder of the season from Fentz League 2 side Troyes. He spent the first half of the season on loan at Cardiff. And a lot of people saying has already slated him already, which I don't like. At the end of the day, let's not slate a player before he's even kicked the ball in anger. If Danny wants him, Danny... Let's see what happens. Uh, he said the 25-year-old brings a lot of experience with over 100 senior starts and 38 goals to his name. He started his career at the academy at Chelsea. He had a loan belt at Barnsley, MK Dons, Gunthorpe, Rhoda JC in Holland and Belgian outfit set, said Brew. And we're going to talk about that in a moment because that one's interesting. Um, a loan switch came when the forward impressed... Uh, Impressed in a four-year contract at a current club. So it'll be interesting to see what happens. He can rep... He's a Canadian uh, player, but he did represent England under 17. So it'll be interesting to see what happens here. He will take number 12. So Ike Ogbob is in the building, which is great. And the thought that another player could be done today or tomorrow, and that player being cover, Connor Coventry, and... Um, it's doing the usual Wednesday thing after they already start following it, so we'll see what happens. But here's the thing at uh, so Bruise, over the course of the 32 games, him and Anthony Masabo were there. They combined for 22 goals and four assists, a goal combined of 1.23 per game, and they managed to finish one place above the relegation playoffs. Uh, in the 2019-20 and the 2021-2022 season. So there's already a link up there with a current player. If him and Masaba can get on the same wavelength again, and that'll help him settle in as well, this could be really handy for Sheffield Wednesday. Now, a lot of people were like, where'd this link up come from? Where's he looking like uh, he'd been? Got to remember, signed at Cardiff. Who was at Cardiff? Kevin Beadle. Who's now head of recruitment? Kevin Beadle. So that's where it all locks in. But this is a fantastic player to get in. I think we got to just see what he can do. Let's not judge him on his stats that he got. Let's just see what he does in a Wednesday shirt and go from there. There's no point slating a player off who's not done anything for the club yet. He's not even kicked the ball in anger. He got straight into training uh, and ready to go. So it's it's interesting. It's the first of another player in. So we've got Beadle and Ugbo in. We said in his press conference today, which I'm probably not going to cover today, uh, just because I'm not going to have time. I might cover it later. It might be a 5 p.m. video, actually. I'll see how I feel and what happens. But he's in. And Danny said there could be another one today. So let's see what happens. There might be, there might not. You never know with these things. Things go fast. So Ike... Ugbo is a Sheffield Wednesday player on loan till the end of the season. Let's see what he can do. Let's see if he helps us get some more goals and pull up more and more out of the situation we're in. We, we need to do. We need to have people who can score those goals and see what happens. So let's see how he does. But welcome to Sheffield Wednesday. <laughs> 